My name is Mitzi Sappas, and I'm very happy to be retired from the Rooney business, <laughs> and I'm really proud of my kids for everything that they've done and are doing. It's phenomenal. But what I do here is I am president of the Historical Society, and I'm the curator, uh, along with Mary Diapoli, we do the exhibits here, which you know, are wonderful, and well, I think they're wonderful. And uh, I actually grew up here, and uh, in my 20s, I moved uh, my son to Fredericksburg, and I got a degree in history, and raised my kids, and then I just felt that tug to come back home. So here I am, and it's been many, many years, you know, and I enjoy every minute of it. Um, and my aha moment has to do with the water specifically. And it's not a new memory, but I had, um, I was doing the ghost thing one weekend, and this young lady came in, and she went back to the waterman's room. She stayed there for like two hours. And when she came out, she was crying. And I was like, are you okay? Is everything all right? And she said, you have pictures in there of my father that I've never seen. And it turned out she was the daughter of a waterman. And uh, his name, not his real name, but his other outlaw. And it just hit me how important this, this is to have this history, to share this history, and make all this connection. And, uh, I'm going to keep on doing it as long as I can. So. I have a question. Okay. What would you like? Like, would you like to get more members? Like, what? What are the? Yes. What's? What's your goals for so the museum? We would love to have more members. We would love to have more docents, volunteers, and we would love to bump this building up. So we're working on that. This building was constructed in 1892, the same year the town was incorporated. So it's a big deal. It's a huge part of our history. And in the beginning, uh, it was taken over. This building had fallen into disrepair. And a bunch of very civic-minded people decided it needed to be rehabbed and they wanted to make it a museum. So I think started that process in 1998. In 1999, the museum opened. And, you know, that's the big part of it. So over time, lots of things have happened. Um, it's an old house, old building, and we really need to give it some TLC. So we are having a campaign to raise money for, for this wonderful building, to keep it, to protect it forever. Thank you.